There you go, sweetie. Oh, let's sit you up. Are you so excited? Yeah. Tuck you in with a blanket. All right. You ready to supervise? Aaron, you gonna you gonna do yard work in those clothes? Yeah. Okay. All right. Hey, girl. Thank you, Gabe. You girls working up my garden? Getting it all scratched up for planting? Ooh, I see some eggs in here. Very nice. Annie, can you go put these eggs in the kitchen? Thank you. Hello friends, welcome to our channel Creating Essence. I am Megan, thank you so much for stopping by. We're getting a little bit of yard work done today. Guys, the first thing we're gonna do is flatten all the cardboard on the porch. We have a few projects that are kind of, eh, we're mid project on them that we're working on. Today is a beautiful day. It's supposed to be a high of around 55 and it's sunny, the wind is minimal. So, it is a great day now that we have the schoolwork done and lunch is finished to get some things done outside before I have to start dinner prep. In our last vlog, a few people noticed the dumpster in our driveway. Last spring, we got a dumpster for a couple of weeks and used it to really deep clean the house. Uh, we had really big goals for it. Um, unfortunately, the people who lived here before us, uh, this was a rental and a lot of stuff was left in the crawl spaces and places where it should not have been. And we foolishly um, didn't do a walkthrough until after we had taken possession of keys after closing. And they said they would clean the stuff out and they did not. And we had no legal recourse. So lesson learned. <laughs> we will do better next time we buy a house. But we got a lot of that done Unfortunately, not really unfortunately, but I was pregnant at that point and very, very low energy because I was at the beginning of the second trimester and still super sick. So there's a lot I couldn't do on my own and Josh was still working outside of the home full time. So he wasn't able to be home much and help me make up the difference to get things done. So we got another one and we are working on finishing cleaning up the grounds, cleaning out the crawl spaces, and really intentionally doing a full clean out of all of our possessions. Because we realized, <laughs> Josh and I still have a lot of things that are just boxes of things that have traveled with us on every move since college, because they really didn't have a place to belong. And as we're going through them now, we're realizing that's kind of because, well, they're pretty much trash at this point. So, how, you, do you like looking at the chickens? Gia's favorite spot while we do yard work is to ride around in the stroller. Yeah! And right now, she's really enjoying watching those chickens over there by the HVAC system. Are you so happy? Yeah. <laughs> So we're starting now up there. The kids are flattening the recycling we've collected, mostly boxes, and they're getting it all flattened out and getting things sorted so we can do any mulching with appropriate brown cardboard and getting the rest of the stuff properly sorted, recycled, or thrown out. Sally, can you do up your boots? I'm afraid you're gonna trip. Switch the feet, they're on the wrong feet and then do up the Velcro. Let me know if you need help, okay? Five-year-old problems. Dave, uh, two of those, uh... It's coated? It's coated. Ah! Stop. It's thunder. Those are sofa pieces. <laughs> <laughs> but that's so funny. Yeah. I do. 
I'm looking through. And then who's going to sweep the porch? I will. I like sweeping. Okay, Ella can sweep it. We are done for the day. The sun has gone down, it is getting chilly. So, we are calling it quits. We used up the rest of our cardboard to lay down, and then we just laid plain wood chips on top of our bed of flower bulbs here. We have a nice mix of gladiolus, peonies, daffodils, and some crocuses. So, just plain wood chips on those since they'll be up before too long in the spring and they'll just kind of help keep them cozy until then. And then when we get more brown cardboard for recycling, we will finish covering that area and wood chipping it. And we have this side completely done now, which is fantastic. It'll get much smoother and nicer looking once it all settles and gets nice and flat. We had to put down some plastic here along this edge grass. I don't know exactly what it's called. I've looked it up numerous times, but it's in abundance over here still. And it is the most obnoxious thing. The only reason we don't have it right here is because I dug it out by hand. It was so thick and heavy and massive root ball that actually left a hole that I had to fill in there with dirt dug from someplace else. It's just obnoxious. If you know what this stuff is, tell me. I hate it with a fiery passion. But it is there for now. We are planning to redo the walk here to rake up all these stones and put in a brick walk that we're hoping to do this summer. This is fantastic progress for today and I'm really excited about that. The kids are finishing up jobs and heading inside. I'm gonna take the trash cans to the curb and go inside and get dinner made. Thank you all so much for hanging out with us today. I would love to hear what kind of outdoor work you are able to do where you are. As always, if you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to hang out for more. We'll see you again soon. Bye friends.